Hey everyone and welcome back to Study Bites. If you watched last week's episode, you'll know that we are now teaching the same content to you in a variety of different ways. So today, once again, we're going to be learning about the divisions of the nervous system, but this time we're gonna be using something called the model memory technique. So today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be associating our clothing items with the divisions of the nervous system. So stay tuned and let's get stuck into it. So this technique works really, really well for groups of things or things that you're trying to remember, you know, which ones sort of go together. So it's perfect for learning the divisions of the nervous system because a lot of them sort of branch off each other and that structure can be a bit tricky to remember. So the first step that I want you guys to do is to write out and organize your content into different sticky notes and preferably color code them as well. So over here I've written out my sticky notes. I have my central nervous system which is made of the brain and the spinal cord. Um, I have my parasympathetic nervous system which branches off into our somatic and autonomic nervous systems and our autonomic nervous system then further branches into the parasympathetic and sympathetic nervous systems. So in step two here, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to stick a label um, that I've made of my sticky note onto my items of clothing. And I'm sort of trying to make a bit of a rough link here as well. So for example, for my central nervous system, it's made up of my brain and my spinal cord. So I'm gonna stick my little brain sticky note on a beanie because um, that's sort of where your brain is, right? Um, and so my second sticky note is the spinal cord. So I might put that on the back of my t-shirt rather than the front. Um, so sort of trying to make loose connections with things, but making sort of an outfit together for each individual nervous system. Now step three is of course the content catwalk. Actually wear the outfits that you have made, okay? Um, you don't have to have a catwalk. I'm a bit of a dag so I would probably do that. Um, but you know it's a fun thing to do if you want to. Um, but you can also put on your clothes or your outfits um, in the days leading up to a test or an exam. Um, and then so when you're sitting in that exam you're gonna be like oh gosh I'm trying to remember um, you know what parts made up the central nervous system. You know what was I wearing when I was learning about that um, and then you'll think okay I was wearing my beanie I was wearing my my t-shirt with the label on the back and I was wearing you know my jeans with the belt on and that's how you're gonna remember the different parts of each nervous system so I hope this technique has been a bit of fun for you guys um, I hope that it's kind of reinforced to you that you know you can learn things in in really different and interesting ways um, and if you do try out this technique at home make sure you send us a comment or even a photo of your outfits below um, we'd love to see them and if you've got any suggestions for different videos you want us to film make sure you send those through as well um, don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you guys for the next study bite